See for that we stay in a joint family. She so she is from a joint family. She knows. So I think that that's a very basic difference with, between children who are brought up in a joint family and ones who are in a uh, singular family. That they have uh, they have a basic this thing of sort of mama papa nahi hai. So there are people around you also who take equal care of you, who love you as much as your parents do, and who feel more responsible to you when your parents are not around. So just getting hyper mama nahi hai, mama nahi hai doesn't work. So she she she's pally with uh, she knows ki mama if she's not around, to daddy is there and uh, all her needs will be met. So one is that taking you know being in a joint family that is an edge over of course, and uh, otherwise when whenever someone comes home, uh, we have this uh, this thing of telling. So she since she's uh, got into her senses she knows sabko jo bhi ghar aaya hai she has to do ram ram to them. So that thing she knows. So people who come home, there's a bear knock on the door. Whether whether she's uh, whether it's uh, concerned or not, she'll do ram ram. So just getting a friendly and uh... <laughs> actually we don't compel him to do a lot of things. So we we let him be na- you know na- natural. So he's a kind of he takes a little time to open up to new people. And uh, we've understood that we don't uh, force him to really go and say hi to everyone and you know start talking. So he he takes a little bit of time. but when he he becomes comfortable he when he becomes comfortable he is really comfortable th- with them so we do, we really don't uh, interfere what we do is i mean we just you know to make him comfortable we let him know that you know he is our relative he'll be with us and we let him know the facts and we just uh, you know let him be his natural self and take things as they come being the youngest one she has uh, you know elder cousins only like elder sisters so uh, we are uh, uh, you know we can tell her not to fight with them share with them and uh, if uh, you know they are kind of possessive about their toys but uh, at that point uh, we need to you know encourage them to share those uh, things uh, with their elder uh, cousins so that's how it is luckily we are uh, you know uh, we are a couple with multilingual skills in the house uh, she is a punjabi i am a gujarati my mom is a maharashtrian so we have uh, the entire nation in the house so what happens is he has a habit of learning all the languages together we try and help uh, him form his sentences and try and point out things and w- what what are the things called mostly in, uh, you know in english language so that's how we do it my kid <laughs> never allows me to talk to my mother <laughs> he will like uh, give me a phone and i will talk yeah we we there you know there is no element of encouragement because he is <laughs> self motivated any time i am talking on phone be it my professional call he would want to take that call first yeah.